Hello, it's me again. I'm back. I'm actually doing a video on friendships, specifically uh, friendships between a gay person and a straight person. There are these myths that a, you know, straight and gay person cannot strictly be friends who just, you know, they get along or whatever. Specifically among men, there's always that, oh, okay, if they're friends, then one, the straight guy is either on the down low and they're sleeping together, or two, the gay guy is trying to seduce or convert or change the straight guy and get him in bed, which, you know, is just ludicrous. Um, I mean, yeah, there are those out there. I'm not naive. I know there are some down low men out there and there are some sneaky gays, okay, some sneaky gays out there, but um, I that's not true for everybody um particularly in men i feel like women sometimes have it easier a woman can be friends with a gay man because he's seen as what i hate to say her accessory don't call me you're gay don't call me your your accessory like this is my gay or this is my accessory no bitch i'm a person i'm a person we are friends but I don't have to be, oh, he's my gay friend, or that's my gay friend. How about just, that's my friend? You know, your sexual, someone's sexuality should not define whether or not they are able, they are worthy of your friendship. I think that's the dumbest thing in the world. Um, so I think women have it a little bit easier if they have a gay friend. Because there's not that stigma. It's just like, oh, she's a woman. You know, she can do that. But if a guy has a gay friend, not a woman. Now, if a guy has a gay lesbian, put it like this. If a guy has a gay feminine girl as his friend people are like oh yeah he's trying to he's trying to get that and uh you know he's trying to bring her back over to this side which is something i hate when they be like bring you to the side sweetie I, there was no exorcism performed on me i didn't die and cross over into a, a spiritual plane or something like what do you mean bring somebody to the other side that's okay but if a man is friends with a um more masculine uh, female, then it's cool. It's like his nigga, his dude, his boy, you know. But I feel like gay men have it the hardest because if a dude is friends with a feminine or masculine gay man, they still might sometimes get that whole mm, something going on, they doing something type of foolishness, which I think is just utterly ludicrous. So I, I, I just hate the double standard, you know what I mean? Um, not only do I hate the double standard, but it's like, are you that insecure about yourself that you feel like, well, if I talk to a gay person or one of them looks at me, then, oh my God, I'm going to turn gay. Sweetie, if you end up sleeping with someone of the same sex, they didn't do that to you. That was in you all along. You were just scared to act on it. That's all I'm saying. You were just scared to act on it. And if you end up sleeping with them, then wow, you acted on it. It's not the end of the world. Continue on with your life. Um... So I, I just wanted to speak on that because I, I um I have a friend and he and I we are really good friends and we you know talk and stuff outside of work we met at work but we talk outside of work we hang out you know I you know my my boyfriend knows him and I have a friend and her girlfriend they love him you know he's he's cool with the gay person and I'm proud of him now he started off as a typical dude like not really all that comfortable around or talking to gay people but you know just like I've done to all other you know, other people before, I showed them that I'm just a human being. I'm not trying to push up on you, not trying to get you booted, not trying to do nothing with you. I just, you know, just saying hello, how you doing, what's up, you know, stuff like that. So, yeah, I just, I just thought I would put that out there that we're not all trying to convert anybody or sleep with anybody and it's okay to have a friend. It's okay to have a friend that is not of the same sex as you. Uh, a friend who's not of the same sexual orientation of you, a friend from a different culture, you know, like a f friend from a different ethnic background. I mean, I feel like that's what makes the world go round is different people branching out, being friends, get to know each other. If you stay friends with someone who is exactly like you, the world would be horrible. No one wants a friend who is exact. I don't ever want to meet anybody who is exactly like me because I'll beat that bitch in the ass because he'll be all stuck up mean sarcastic little bitch and i would never want to deal with me um my friends are very strong because i would slap the piss out of me but anyway but I, don't y'all try it but yeah that's it that's all i wanted to say my opinion